Hi, this is Biff Bradford from Saxon. You're watching TV Rock Live. Yeah. I went to Mexico last year and um, we did the Mayan temple thing with a nice guy, a nice old guy telling me about the sacrifices and things, so I quite liked it, you know. I like the Inca artwork, the Mayan, Mayan artwork on the cover. Connects nice, good heavy metal title. Good, a bit di difficult doing it on my own, um, but yeah, good, good, it was a good, good experience. Uh, trying to get the best out of the band. We just, I just wanted the guitars to be um, to be powerful. Uh, I wanted some more uh, twin lead guitar parts, you know, like the old days. Um, but I still wanted it to have that modern that modern feel to it, you know, not too uh, not too old fashioned. But I think you know, being back to the roots a bit is great. And so on some of the songs, it works really well. Made in Belfast, another history song. It, that area of Belfast was the biggest, um, was the biggest ship building yard in the world. They built the Titanic there and the Lusitania, and a lot of big ships were built there. And um, they lost, they lost everything. Um, so it's just a song about the men, women that used to work there, really. Yeah, I played a bass a lot on, on writing the songs on the album. Yeah, we sometimes, you know, if, if Nigel's busy, Nibs plays drums and I play bass. So on this album, Nibs was back in Germany, his wife was ill. So a lot of the songs we wrote, I played bass on. So, you know, we can all play different instruments. So, you know, we're pretty, we're pretty good all round musicians. I play keyboards as well, so. We've been doing it for about two, two, two and a half years. We have a lot of different stuff we experimented with, you know. Um, so yeah, there will be some more things around next year that we've done, uh, unplugged and re-recorded and orchestrated, yeah. It's been around quite some time. Not for release, it was first released to our fan club, just online, 2,000 copies. We had artistic um, uh, control over it. But yeah, it's good. It tells a good story. You know, um, pretty similar to my book, really. It's basically the same, you know. We're doing four or five big festivals headlining with the big production with the Eagle and the Flames, like the Vacan production. Um, so we, I mean, we're doing about six festivals. We're doing Sweden Rock again, a Bang Your Head, um, obviously Grass Pop. We're talking to Hellfest, but nothing's been confirmed yet. say I was afraid I mean people adapt don't they you know um, obviously in the 80s things were pretty bad in England in the 80s a lot of rioting and a lot of problems with the police and the government so you know I mean England in the 80s was like France you know the unions were fighting the police and la la la, la. so you know from that from that time um, Saxon and Iron Maiden and two or three other bands came out of that time. So it, sometimes it's, it's not always bad if the people, you know, say, fuck you sometimes, you know. So 
but you know it's it's how it is my children will grow up in their time and they'll have to deal with it you know basically like i had to <laughs>